So hi everyone, today we have a special guest on our channel, we have Manthan with us. So Manthan, would you like to introduce yourself? Uh, yes, my name is Manthan Dilip Prabhagai, from, I am from basically from Maharashtra, Yavutman. And I have studied in uh, uh, Sri Santa Gajana Maharashtra College of Engineering, Shegao, as my Bachelor of Mechanical Design Engineering. And I am now currently working in uh, Alt Green, uh, which is the automotive company. Mm-hmm. Yes, sir. yes, yes, yes. So we'll be learning about his journey, how he came to got how he got his first job after finishing his mechanical engineering. So tell us about your interview experience, man. How did you get this interview? How did you get this opportunity? How was the interview experience? Uh, basically, the interview uh, everyone know it is stressful, but uh, <laughs> due to the skill link, I have get the chance to interact with the real life persons or uh, which mm-hmm. are working in the companies. So they have provided me the uh, knowledge how they are uh, doing the job in the real life mm. uh, or real time projects. So it will be lots of more than uh, the industry experience. So mm-hmm. they, it will give me the confidence and the interview process is just if you know the some uh, technical skill or theory about that, then it will be easy for you. So how was the interview experience with this company? Like how many rounds were there? What kind of questions were you asked? Uh, first, uh, there are three rounds. First round, uh, mm-hmm. just about the basic uh, of the CAD. They have given the, the uh, part, and I have to create the sheet metal part from this inner panel and outer panel. The hood is the part. So, mm-hmm. if we clear that round, they will. Uh, they have to give the report also with that. So I have created mm-hmm. the report also and the uh, uh, model, and uh, then it will be eligible for the second round and uh, in second round they have given the they have taken for the technical round with HR and the hmm. subordinates of their company and uh, in that they have asked about the technical questions all about related to the uh, BIW and automotive sector and somewhat about the uh, bomb or so so hmm. after that they have taken the th- uh, third round it was only related to some technical and HR related things. So that mm-hmm. was the journey about the interview. Mm-hmm. All right, great, great, great. Mm-hmm. Okay, so like you said, because of skill link, you know, you were able to come to a position that you performed nice. well in the interview and you had got in the interview because of skill link. So how was it like in the skill link course? What course had you taken and how was it for you? Uh, I have taken the master course of uh, production design. Mm-hmm. Uh, it is called as a postgraduate program in masters in design or something like that. Uh, mm-hmm. They have five or six modules of different different uh, production types. So they have given the basic idea about all the automotive sectors. Mm-hmm. So how was your review of the course? How did you feel like it was? How did it help you in you know clearing these uh, interviews? For review, I will give the skill link as out of 10, 9. The course is basically divided into uh, the theory portion and the challenges, the challenges which are related to the industry. So we have to uh, go to the theory part first. Then we have to uh, complete our challenge. By completing the challenge, we have to do our work by uh, benchmarking. Benchmarking means we have to search for the data on the mm-hmm. Google or anything and then we have to create the uh, basic structure and we can do that project then. Mm-hmm. That's all the project and uh, about that uh, if you have doubt then they have the uh, most basic and uh, best facility to interact with the teachers. We can get uh, the session by uh, booking the session or now they have joined uh, the live session option also. So mm-hmm. it will be available for all the day. The video are uh, mostly basic level so anyone can mm-hmm. be understand but the challenges are the industry level so that will be mm-hmm. tough for us to solve that in some cases we are getting doubt in some cases software issue or something like that but uh, if you get if you talk with the mentor it will be easy for you so it was a good facility for the uh, students also and the working professionals so you had live classes and apart from that you had assignments that you had to complete uh, yes. along with that right Yes. Right, right, right. So, what was the difficulty of the interview that you faced for the actual company? How was it like? 
फॉर द एक्चुअल कंपनी दे आर जस्ट द कम्युनिकेशन गैप मोस्टली फॉर मी द कम्युनिकेशन सो आई एम जस्ट लैगिंग दैट ओनली बट ड्यू टू द कोर्स इट विल बी इजी फॉर मी एंड वॉट अबाउट द टेक्निकल एस्पेक्ट टेक्निकल एस्पेक्ट वाल ऑल क्लियर बाय द कोर्स Uh, if you go for interview, they will ask the basic question that we you are going with the <laughs> already six done. weeks or already done. So that's all we see. Mm-hmm. So you can say that majority of the questions that you come across in the interview for majority of the companies were already covered by the course yes, that you yes. were in, right? Yes. Mm-hmm. Nice, nice, nice. So to those of the people who are watching, you know, who also want to become mechanical engineer, who are from core branches and they want to get into mechanical engineering, design engineering, and you know, crack the core placements, what advice would you give to those people? Uh, first of all, they should clear their all subjects and they should focus mm-hmm. on the design subjects. Uh, all all our people know the graphic design and mom swam. These are the subjects. Uh, we need to focus on that subject because in design sector. we should know we will feel like that if you know the software we will do the things on all the things are okay but no if you don't know the theory and all the all the aspect behind that for production knowledge and and some formulas and all the things you can't able to do the design you will just design hmm, the things true. but uh, it will not be like uh, produ- uh, producible or uh, manufacturing processable or co- it will be more costly or something like that or wastage of material so mm. you should focus on the your uh, syllabus first and then software and mm. uh, for the other things such as all the interview questions and all th- that that will be taken care of your college study and and on you also mm-hmm. right and for resources you can take something like skill link or even watch videos on youtube right a lot of resources will be available yes. for self studying as well okay so i think that goes pretty much everything about you know coming from mechanical branch and cracking a co placement into a good company so thanks a lot manthan for coming on my channel and sharing your journey and experience with skill link as well so again thank you thank you